I mean, I look great with long hair, but, you know, not favourable. As an artist, you know, drawing people is hard. But you can always get the hair. It's like really recognisable. It's like, you can't imagine someone with a different hairstyle unless you're like looking at it. Men have short hair and girls have long hair. It's like this whole thing and that just kind of became a norm. It, I think getting a haircut would help me pass a lot better because like I've been told I like I have a pretty masculine face. It's just like, I really want to, but I'm terrified. You know, different hair does change you. And like afterwards, it's either I'm gonna laugh and like just be like, oh yeah, this is cool. And then it's like no bigger deal. And then I'm gonna get home and like cry from joy. Primary and secondary school, I went to Catholic schools. There's a lot of stuff that's just really taboo. You're not allowed to question some stuff and like, if like any kind of hostility is seen as extremely rude. In primary, I was teased a f like a lot. It's just been going on for as long as I could remember. Like I wasn't very social. I had like three friends and we were we were close but I was like I'm pretty sure they didn't like me. I've always been like deeply ashamed of like what I'd like because it was different I guess. I'd always bring like toys into school because I thought it was cool like I liked showing my friends the stuff that I had. My favorite was a pink horse named Ollie but some some mean kid bumped me and I dropped her in a puddle. And, like she was completely ruined and I never saw her again after that. I can only assume that she was thrown away. My older sister would always go out with my mum to get like the nails done. It'd be really nice. I felt really out of place. I just wasn't that interested in it. My mum would always talk about how lucky they were to have three girls because it's very rare for that happening. And that's like part of the reason I was just didn't want to come out. Like I was like, you know, I just, I'm ruining the whole family dynamic. This is a big deal. Like even now, I technically just didn't come out to my family. It just kind of happened. The first day of college, I was going in and the teacher was like, oh, what's your name? And I panicked and I was like, I go by Owen. And I was like, really, it was a really small, like scared little voice. And I just went in. I thought that would be the end of it, right? But then people started calling me Owen. It was the best thing ever. Is it like a good feeling or it's great? Right now, what I'm feeling is that my hair is being pulled and cut. <laughs> I personally do not like being trans. It kind of sucks. First impressions, like I can't rely on those. I have to make a good second impression because like if you see me like on a train or something, you're not going to know I'm trans. And like you'd probably see me in a way that I do not want to be seen. Like no one sees me the way I want to be seen. I like to distance myself from the trans community just because it's like I don't want to be seen as trans I want to just be seen as a guy for me I think it's just like the physical part I'm very dainty and like you know I'm short like for a man you know you'd see a profile of someone you'd be like oh that's a guy or that's a girl like I'd always fit into the the latter category because like I slump, you know, I don't like to stand up straight because, you know, it would expose my chest and I don't really want to do that. It's like a problem with me rather than with other people. I wear a big jacket because I'm insecure, I'm like trying to hide like from myself and it's like, I just don't really want to deal with it. I don't like looking in mirrors very much, I just like, barely recognize anything. I see a tiny head 
with a massive stupid hat, a mirror just shows what's there. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't care what you feel about it. I like to focus on my eyes because like, you know, they're just round circles, you know, there's, there's no gender on those. can change a lot. I think I'm gonna downplay how I feel like. I think I'm just gonna be either extremely ecstatic and like just hide it. Like it would definitely take some getting used to. Like even if I loved it, like if I loved it or hated it, it would take getting used to. Yeah, if anything, I think we've learnt that it's it's not really just hair, is it? It's absolutely not. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs>